and we actually have two other cameras that are even smaller than this one now. So for those customers that are doing the studio camera, they need a live camera. We have one that's literally about the size of a tennis ball that a lens can go on. Hi, Sue Lawson here, NAB 2015 with BSVP on site. I am joining Tina Ekman from Black Magic Design. A micro studio camera can be controlled from the switchers, all the technology that you expect, but with an expansion port on the side that allows you to connect a B4 lens to it with full lens control, which in its $12.95. Which so is a ridiculous micro. price. <laughs> yes, and for even less, we have the micro cinema camera because people were taking our, you know, our bigger handheld camera and trying to put it in drones and in cars and hang it off the side of things. So we've made it Oops. Safe. Yes. <laughs> It works, but now we have the same, um, it's basically the same sensor as the Pocket, the HD camera, gorgeous, really tiny, and you'll see it in the front flying on drones. So, so great things here from Blackmagic Design, and everything is, not everything is available just yet. July, a lot of the stuff, I mean, we have a few products coming out in May, a lot of the 12 gig products. July um, is for DaVinci Resolve, and then some of the cameras in July. The sensor, the upgradable sensor, URSA users that have the 4.0 can upgrade to the 4.6, and that probably will be first for the cameras, and then the minis will follow, as well as the studio camera. Absolutely awesome. Tina, thank you so much for spending time with us. She's taken us on a lovely tour of Blackmagic Design World. All information on this can be found, of course, on their website, blackmagicdesign.com. Sue Lawson for BSVP on site here at NAB 2015.